students had to write either about uh, their favorite fishing story, what fishing means to me, or how can my generation help improve the fishery stocks uh, in the world. And as I say, we had 350 entries, and the categories were first to third grade, fourth to sixth, seventh to ninth, and then high school. So uh, what, I, what I'll do is run through starting uh, bottom to top, and the first winner in the grade one to three category, first place essay, Frankie Carroll. Second place, uh, uh, second category, grades four to six, first place winner, Patrick Zutska. I also wanted to just thank, we got tremendous support from Shimano, Rapala, uh, Albright, Tackle, um, you know, and a whole bunch of other uh, organizations, uh, that, that Tsunami, just a bunch of great folks. Yes, Patrick. Patrick, your certificate. Certificate? Okay. Okay. Great job. And so much just great reflections on even when I was a child and why I took up fishing and when I, why I became involved. So some of these stories were absolutely fabulous. You can, you can see them uh, on a, in a couple of places. They'll be posted. Charlie Whittick here is from CCA, uh, Coastal Conservation Association. They were one of the sponsors, as was uh, on the Water Magazine. Those, both of those facilities on their websites will have the stories. They're up there now. They're also on the Long Island Outdoor Communicators Facebook page. So if you go to it and you like the stories, give us a little like, you know, and uh, the stories are free there, free to read. Uh, third place, third category, first place, grades seven to nine, uh, is Claudia Motley, and an ex I've always wanted to say this, and accepting on her behalf <laughs> is Dan Lassess, her, her teacher who got her involved in the process. So, Dan, Mike, uh, they were absolutely fabulous. They got their classes involved. We had some classes that the entire class submitted entry. So, and, and it was really tough determining these winners. I mean, that's how good the stories were. But we have for um, that, that, and this. So she has a uh, nice fly rod, nice spinning rod to get her involved. Okay, thank you so much for all your help. Um, <laughs> High school category, and unfortunately, uh, um, this young young girl, her mom was hospitalized yesterday in intensive care, so they couldn't uh, make it here today. But the high school winner, first grade, Lindsay Mackerlane, Saint I believe Saint John the Baptist High School, um, and uh, I will I'll get these to her uh, over the weekend. But these were her prizes, and I just want to thank everyone.